The reason why rice is such a phenomenally important food is the sheer amount of energy that is packed into each one of these tiny grains. And I can actually show you how much energy they have visually, but first, I've got to break them open. Grinding the rice tears the tightly packed starch chains apart, making the energy in the carbohydrates easier to unleash. This stuff might not look very exciting, but it's packed full of energy. You can convert the potential energy that's stored in the rice grains into heat and light energy just by doing this. Each puff is around a third of an ounce. <laughs> I could do this all day. And contains about 35 calories of energy, all going up in flames. And almost all of it comes from carbohydrates. Now, our bodies might not do this in the exact same way, because we use complex biochemistry to do it. And rice doesn't give up its energy without a fight. But we have discovered another way to harness its power. Even once fully processed, rice is essentially indigestible, because starch really stubbornly holds on to its energy. Until you do this. Cooking is the game changer. The starch in the rice is made up of two energy-giving carbohydrate molecules, amylose and amylopectin. But their long chains are packed together, making them mostly indigestible. The combination of heat and water has the power to break the tangled chains apart. This chemistry is going on inside every grain. And magnified 600 times, we can see the effect on the cells as the boiling water makes them swell. Even the moment when they burst open and the digestible carbs erupt. Thank you.